what it is here. Gas is so cheap, they're flying in from other places. Hey. Five hundred scattered. Temperature three three Celsius dew point two three altimeter two niner niner six density altitude two one zero zero. Williston Municipal Airport Automatic Weather Observation One Six Five Six Zulu Weather Wind Two Niner Zero at eight visibility one zero four thousand seven hundred scattered five thousand five hundred scattered temperature three three celsius dew point two three altimeter two niner niner six density altitude two one zero zero Williston Municipal Airport Automatic Weather Observation 1657 Zulu Weather Wind 280 at 8 Visibility 104,000 Scattered 5,500 Scattered yeah, you. Temperature it looks like we're going to runway 23 two, Altimeter 2 Niner Niner Are you with me? Say again, I didn't hear you it looks like we are going to runway 23. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, no. It's it's runway 5. Because yeah. the wind, I'm sorry, the wind is... Is uh, 230? Doesn't make sense, does it? That's what it looks it like it's going down the runway to me. That's what it does to me. Yeah. The wind sock. No, that's not going down the runway. I mean, that's not going out of 280. No. 280, 280 is, uh, let's see, 280 is in back of me. That wind's not in back of me. Right. If it's 280, we should be taking off on 23. Yeah, but not according to that wind sock. See that? Yeah, I see what you're talking about. Looks to me, doesn't look like the uh, 230. No, I agree with you. So we could make we could make a right a right turn here. Yeah. And just go down Alpha. I agree with you, that wind yeah, stock is coming down that runway. Yeah, see look, he's coming in on five, see it? Oh yeah, okay. See the guy landing? Yeah, yeah. That's the one we would have picked anyway then. Back the runway. Okay, uh half lights on, strobe light on. Hey, we got full fuel, oil pressure, temperature good. Now, what's here? What's here? What's here? This, uh... We gotta go Alpha. Yeah, Alpha to the end of five. Right. What's that taking me to? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on a sec. Let me just make sure I'm going to the right spot. Um, that could be. Hey Lake, where are you going? So we're, we're looking for runway. runway. We're looking for runway five. Hang a left there, sharp left. Uh, go down Alpha. Okay. Roger that. Right back of me.
that run? I don't know. That's going probably to the other runway. Yeah, 32 and all that. Uh, there we go. We'll assist traffic, Skyhawk, November 218, Remy Alpha, currently 7 miles. All right, let me get this closed, Bob. 45 degrees. Uh, left downwind join for runway 32, full stop, Williston traffic. Runway th Second 32. Yeah. But. Okay, let's go ahead and do it here. It's on. Hydraulic pressure is good. Oil temperature pressure. Fuel pressure. Amperes. I'm strapped. Bob strapped. Who's that guy coming in for a And uh, some Englishman. Both mags. Both battery and alternator on. Fuel pump. Hydraulic pump on. Two, two, two. Okay. Pressure's up. Flaps are down. Water rudders up. Trim set. Right. Prop high. Mixed down for right. Taking five. All right. Williston traffic, Lake Amphibian 2536 pop, departing runway 5, Williston, to or for a uh, right turn to 135, Williston. Coming down the runway. It is. Can't even believe that shit. He's leaving the, uh, leaving with his, uh, Adis. give you accurate information. Yeah. I would say it's right down this runway. Yeah, I'd say so too. Gear up. Romeo Alpha is joining the 45 degree left downwind from runway 05. Change Yeah, he's left downwind now. Yeah, he changed it. Over there somewhere. All right, Bob. Off at 103. 103. Off at 103, Bob. Desired track 135. Hey, 135. Make a right turn out, I'll get a little farther out. Yeah, it's a good idea. They're up. Flaps are coming up. Yeah, and you know what? It's good to gain some altitude here. Yeah. While you got a landing field right nearby. Yeah. Yeah, if you lost your engine, you can put the nose down and land right over there, couldn't you? Definitely. Yeah. But not over the trees. Now, when I used to fly out of Prairie Lake, that Navy pilot that ran the high school uh, told me when you took me for a ride in his uh, airplane, uh, uh, all on floats, he said, make a left turn and follow the railroad tracks. So that way, if you have an engine out laying on the railroad tracks, it's wide open. Of course, it's going to ruin your airplane, but you're going to get out of it, you know? Yeah. Midfield, left downwind, full stop, runway 05, Williston traffic. Oh, yeah, those English. He's over there. Yeah. This is really a pretty country. I like flying up here. I like this countryside. Well, I say that uh, Crazy Carol's got quite a history. Yeah. He's done it all. Yep. Hey, I don't 
see any traffic to worry about. Hey. You see that? Right below, right? Oh, what, what am I looking at? Right down the left side of the plane, it looks like, uh, power lines. See that? I don't see the power lines, I see the big highway, a four-lane highway. Yeah, that's taking us right home. Oh, it is? Was that 441? Uh, it could be. But it's in no, I don't think 441 goes through Bozeman, it goes through, no, no, it goes through Gainesville. It's in the direction of the way we want to go, right? But we got to get back on course. Well, we're trying. Yeah, we will. Forty-four minutes, Bob. Fifty-seven miles. Okay, our EGT is not working.
tower. Okay. And we're number one radio. Tom one is a popter. Number two radio. Ocala Tower. Okay. any traffic, Bob. Good. I mean, nothing to worry about. Out the six miles. Ocala. We're on number two. What do we need? Too much. No. Ocala Tower, Lake 2536 Pop. Five to the northwest. Proceeding overhead 2500 to the southeast. 2536 Pop. Uh, that's a parameter. We'll call when we are uh, past your airspace. Thanks. What did he say? I didn't hear him. Sure 
sees us. Oh, yeah. I did a report because they have incoming traffic and also somebody that takes off and climbs. Remember the guy I told you that answered? Yeah. Spiraled up. Yeah. Right into my airspace. I like a 2500. He took off. I heard him. The clearance he take off. I never thought he'd be up in the airspace with me. But he spiraled up. And went up yeah. Trip. Thought he was being safe by spiraling up. Actually being pretty good. People do dumb things, because they think they're smart. Uh, unless he had an engine that he wasn't sure of, he wanted to spiral over the board, make sure it's... And it didn't be full power and... No, he should, let, he, he should let people know what he's doing, though. Uh, you should tell him that. You should say, I'm going to spiral up to about 3,000 feet. I'd have been looking for... the price the shit out of it. I heard him take off. I never expected him to be right up within within two minutes. It was like this high, you know? That's right. I think I see Lake Bear. You see it. We're going to be like airline pilots. We have a route. <laughs> we know we know our route of flight. That's right, Bob. Hundred five knots. Three minutes, Bob. I think it was a good idea to get fuel. I did, both for that price, yeah. We'll do our test of the tanks of the... I know they're both working because... Uh, I had to put about uh, five gallon or three gallons in each one. Yeah. Okalatawa, Lake 2536 Pop, outside of your class delta, heading southeast. 2536 Pop, Okalatawa, Roger, appreciate you change the route. Have a good day. Okay, so let's get back over to. 12305. Yeah, see what's going on. See what they're doing. 22 minutes. I, th I think shooting the approach is a good idea because it takes flight to the airport. Now we can make a left downwind for 3-3. We have. 